When I get challenged, it's, it's not so much proving the person wrong, it's proving to myself that I can do anything. I was one of those kids uh, who would run everywhere and run all around the house, you know, play freeze tag and, and ghost in the graveyard with the neighborhood kids. And, and I would always be that kid who was you know, by the pool running and the lifeguards would yell at me. Hey, you know, I run because it's fun. Once I decided that, that sports were going to be a part of my life, that's when running really became important. But I really found that you know, I needed to start running to be better at running. And I hit that line and try to be in full stride and, and I just sprint as fast as I can. And people are running in front of you, blurring your vision. You know, you talk about running through a wall. You know, some of these guys are six, five, 310 pounds. And, you know, I'm a big guy, but I'm not that big. If I'm running fast enough, you know, I can run through them. I started feeling a pain in my leg and it was, you know, it wasn't a, a regular pain from a muscle soreness. You know, I knew something was wrong, but I couldn't figure out what it was. So we got into the doctor's office and four doctors walked in and they told me, they said, um, you have a large uh, tumor in your left femur and um, we're about 99% sure it's cancer. That's tough for a 21 year old kid to hear. You feel like you know, nothing can stop you and then bam, you get told that you have cancer. I got home after that doctor's appointment and it was about two hours when I was in my bed by myself thinking, asking why me? And there was a turning point. I said, all right, these doctors know cancer. They know medicine, but they don't know what I'm capable of. They don't know me. And I said, right then, I said, I'm, I'm not gonna let it beat me. I don't know how I'm gonna do it, but I'm going to run. I'm going to play football again. It's like I had to relearn how to run. It, everything was, you know, all new again. You know, I had a, a, a new leg. You know, I had a metal rod through it. The muscles weren't working right. I would go out every single morning and, and run a mile, and then uh, you know, it got to where I could run two miles. That running started to get me back in shape. It get, started getting me to where I needed to be to go play football. And how do you get over being told you have cancer? How do you find a way to fight through? You find something inside of you that pushes you to be better. If they told you you couldn't run again, well, you're gonna prove them wrong and you're going to run faster than you did before. I'm Mark Hurtley, and my strong is not accepting defeat.